the true stuff is the best stuff. You can't make it up. Last February, I had a theater show in South Florida, and then I had one in Orlando and St. Pete. It was a little tour. So I was driving my rental car on the Florida tow pike, and I wanted to stop. I needed to get gas, and I wanted just a bottle of water because I was dieting a little bit. You know, I'm tall, and y'all can't tell it, but I can balloon up. <laughs> And I got the gas and I went in and there were fast food chains everywhere and there were lines at every one of them. But one of them didn't have a line, but it had a big sign that said milkshakes. And I thought, forget the diet. I'm getting a milkshake. And I went over and as I came up to the counter, a family of four came and maybe the kids were five and six and a young couple. And we did that dance, you go ahead dance. And finally he said, it's going to take me a few minutes here. I said, thank you, I'll go ahead. And a young clerk came up. Now, I'm not making fun of your age group, but the conversation went like this. I said, I think I will have a vanilla milkshake. She said, we don't sell vanilla milkshakes. I said, oh, really? Are you out of vanilla milkshakes? No, ma'am, we're not out of vanilla milkshakes. And I said, oh, hmm. And then she went on and said, we sell chocolate milkshakes. We sell strawberry milkshakes. We just don't sell vanilla milkshakes. I said, not a problem. I will have a chocolate milkshake. And I looked at this young father and he nodded and said, that sounds good. She went over here and got out a stainless steel cup, the tall one that you make milkshakes in, put it under a machine and pulled down a handle and out came vanilla. <laughs> She filled up the whole cup. He looked at me and said, they must have replaced it while she was on break. <laughs> I said, I guess so, but I'm gonna get my vanilla milkshake. Then she stepped over two steps and put it under a machine and pulled down a lever and a squirt of chocolate came out. <laughs> and then she did it again, but this time it gave out as though you knew that was all the chocolate. <laughs> on this, she was not daunted. She stepped over, put the whole thing under another machine, whirr, put it in a cup, put it in front of me and said, one chocolate milkshake. <laughs> and I said, well, I appreciate it. That's what I ordered. Thank you very much. And I turned to leave. And then I thought, what are people my age still doing on earth if we're not here to help the youth? <laughs> I said to the man, may I have another minute? He said, I'm going to watch it. <laughs> I stepped back up and said, can I talk to you just a minute? And I said, I got my chocolate milkshake and it's what it ordered and you've been very nice and I appreciate it. But I was just wondering, have you ever thought, <laughs> just maybe one day when you're on break, <laughs> that if you just put the cup under that first machine over there, and the vanilla came out, and when you got to the top of the cup, you stopped right there, you just stopped. You would have a vanilla milkshake. She said, ma'am, we don't sell vanilla milkshakes. <laughs> I said, I know that, I understand that, but it would seem to me you could do that and your person would get what they want. She said, let me explain, and this shows you there are always two sides. This is the younger generation. She said, we are all on computers now. The way she said it was like, have you ever heard of a computer? <laughs> We're computerized now. We don't sell vanilla milkshakes and I couldn't you sell you that vanilla milkshake because there is not a button on this thing to mash <laughs> to charge you for a vanilla milkshake. I said, well, when I came along, if we had had that machine, we would punch chocolate and give the customer a vanilla milkshake. And I stared at her, and she stared back, and I saw the light bulb come on in her head. It's like, ding! Just lit up her ears, it came out of her eyes. She got it, and I said, just think about it sometime when you do. And I took my milkshake and walked away, and I got back to here, and I stopped to take the 
paper off the top of my straw and up stepped the family. And by now, his children wanted a chocolate milkshake. That's what they had seen me get. He stepped up and said, we'll have four chocolate milkshakes. And she said, we're out of chocolate milkshake. <laughs> and then she looked past this man right at me and smiled and said, but I can get you four vanilla milkshakes if you want. 